three. Hello. Ah, was I not coming in before? Alright, cool. And actually, I can hear that pretty fine on my phone, but I just worry about Echo. But, woo! Alright. Ah, um, yeah. Yeah, that's fair. Sorry, still sorry to hear that. Be, uh... Yeah. Ah, oh, yes, I did all that last time. Where... I did. No, I, I can mess around with that later. Um... Yeah, check the reflection next to the flower. Yeah. Uh, where is it? Oh. Huh. Let's see, now to just uh, read from chat. Um, by the way, check out the reflection next to that flower. That flower is in each zone for some reason. I don't think they mean anything, but this one in the reflection zone has uh, reflections. Yeah, that's really cute. And the symmetry zone outside the, the vase room has a pair. Nice. That's cute. Uh, run button. Yeah. I'm trying to... Yeah, uh, it's. Ooh, I I've had a rough <laughs> run for a while, so I'm trying to remember what all happened last time. See, we did this. There's that one puzzle that was really hard just because I couldn't see it well enough. That was great. Um. Anyway. And yeah, the laser is pointing the wrong way, and I've noticed that. It's not matching up. Oh, hello. That one's pointing... I, for some reason, what game was I playing that had a zoom? Oh, yes, I was playing Prey on my free time. Um, but yeah, the symmetry one is pointing over there. Which I'm guessing makes a... Symmet uh, a bi uh, symmetri symmetrical line through the island. The desert one doesn't even seem to be going to the center of the island or anything. That's also strange. Wait. This is a very pretty lake, but I'm so used to there being weird nonsense <coughs> environmental puzzles that my mind's like, oh, the sun looks like a dot on the lake. If there's some noise I can do with it. But now I, I should just really take in how pretty this lake is. Like, it's fantastic. I don't remember, where have I been before? Oh! Oh. This doesn't look like a person turned into stone, but just a person that's chiseled to look like stone. Looks like he's juggling. Hmm. Um... Uh.
I don't think I've seen this tutorial yet. Um, I I wonder if I can guess it. Um, um, and you know, to read from chat again. The, uh, the town is an essay, with the end of the game being an exam. Hmm, interesting. Very fascinating. <gasps> no, that doesn't feel right. No, also doesn't feel right. No, I'll <coughs> find the tutorial for that later. Beautiful. Love that flower. <clears throat> no, no. Oh, there's so many. No, oh, what? The lasers head into the upstairs of here? Is it? No. Oh, it's heading up there, yeah. Oh, where's the desert? Ah. can do. <clears throat> hmm. Yeah, I think I'm I have the right idea, just not lined up correctly. No, but, um, to quote from Pinmon again, but as I said, this is the final essay. So you could potentially keep coming back as you learn mechanics, or you can wait until you cleared all the other lasers first. No, that is fair. Also, I'm still not sure on how to line this up correctly, per se. Oh, wait. That Okay, I think I I 
I'm, I'm... That's... Outlining the green tree drops, yeah. Hmm. Okay, I think I have it now. No, oh, this one looks... Oh. Oh, I don't have the laser for it yet. Alright. No, that's fair. Yeah, I'll come back to this. Um, let's follow that laser then. I keep hearing water rushing water from this area. I'm guessing there's like... I don't know, a something. No. I puzzle I don't have the laser for yet. You could Bruce Bruce force it, but the laser zones teach you. That laser intersects with the top of the small building. A nice re relaxing place to chill out and have a whiskey. Yeah? Looks like it. No, I've actually never had a whiskey. Ah, uh, someday it'd be nice to. Or maybe not exactly a whiskey per se. I'm like, to be honest, I'd rather have some incredibly fruity ass drink. Because I do honestly have a sweet tooth. I that does look like a something that whiskey a whis that whiskey glass. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. And I see that same sim symbol is here. Also, I want to make the sun go into the goblet. You could potentially read the shadow as him having reached the grail or as a framed picture of someone throwing a ball. Oh, yeah. Really could. Oh, that's a really nice touch. I didn't notice that before, actually. And now I'm blind. Um, where's that laser pointed? Did I go in the complete wrong direction? Oh, wait, no. Oh, yeah, it's going somewhere incredibly off into the distance. No, it is... Partially, I feel like if I solve a puzzle or something, um, something will align to actually intersect with that uh, laser, but... Oh, I think there's some other place. Actually, let's... Uh-huh. Fascinating. Da da. Oh. What would it still line up if? What? Uh. Oh, fascinating.
the, the what? Oh, it did, what? Yeah, the claw did change. From light to dark. What? Oh! What? How far can I tilt this while still having the... That... Too far. No. Oh! That feels right. But, huh, that became a dark cloud. That's... that's fascinating. I'm going to add a C marker so that dark cloud plus laser equals a light cloud. Yeah. Uh, so that, <laughs> hopefully I remember to make note of this. Or something. I should really make an LP zone. Help me keep track of some notes. Anyway. If this is kind of like... You're supposed to come here once you've learned all the other lessons or something, or several other lessons, and uh, come back to visit it later when I hurt. <sighs> oh, gosh, this game hot. <laughs> oh, wait, this is the starting area. Ah, this feels about right. Wait. If it is, I vaguely remember you telling me that there is a Dorito hidden somewhere. Oh, okay, I started in the keep. This is the castle. Nice. Let me climb over oh, these hedges, please. Ba -da 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 -da. You know. Um. Um. Did it follow the path to get here? Uh, can I remember that? <laughs> Alright. It was kind of something... vaguely like this? No. Wait. No. <laughs> I can remember things. Uh, let's... Made a little... Uh, then there's that. That the goes around. Yeah, no. Left. Almost till the end. Do this turn, skip the thing. Alright. Alright, cool. Little shortcut. And then... Um... There's no blocking paths here. You start from the left. 
like that works. Something tells me that won't work here. That it's specific Ah, oh, okay, I see it now. Alright, um let me think about this. Start from left. We go Okay, no. You start, go right, left, left, right, right, er, no. Hmm. I feel like I'm doing something wrong here. Alright, go right, left, right, down, right, up, to, left, up, right. I hope I made any amount of sense with that. Alright, cool. Yay. I can now reach the battlements. Oh. Oh no. What on earth happened here? Oh, and in the smear... There's a bathtub full of pitch, and in the smear of the edge is a reference to mist. Smear on the edge. Now I'll... Now I see this path and I want to make an environmental puzzle. And to uh, read from chat again, I consider that bucket head to be a mandrake made of pitch slash soil. Now it. Yeah, it does kind of have that shape of mandrake. Like that wispy ish kind of look to it. Hmm. <clears throat> oh, you think the bathtub you're talking about is in the left bat is in the first battlement to the left where you go up the stairs. What tub? No, oh, here? Not ah, here. There, yeah, that's filled with pitch. And in the smear on the edge is... Ah, there it is. Ah, that's really cool. Yeah, that is the fa the falling body from Mist. Very nice. Oh, this one's kind of a pain. Um, I should get my notepad for this. <clears throat> Give me a second. You know, being at my desk at least allows me to uh, get to my notes a lot quicker. Or get to a notepad at least. A lot quicker. Yeah, I was about to 
do that. Just give me a sec. Alright. Yeah. Gosh, this one is kind of <laughs> annoying. <laughs> not gonna lie. Like, I, I get it. And it's not, like, the worst thing in the world, but, like, like, I think it might have drawn my map a bit wrong, but whatever. I think I completely did my map. Yeah, I think it. Okay, I kind of did it wrong, but it worked out in the end. Or I accidentally made the right of being. Is this another sound one? I figure that they don't repeat, but I thought it would be worth checking and walking through it again to make sure that it didn't repeat. Mm. Ah, sorry, I had to drink some water. And... Yeah, alright. So, Fences Foilid Voyage Sound. B. 
give him these nice plants around them. I should have drawn the map before going in here. Oh well. Hmm. I'm not noticing anything. Not all. Oh, this gives me a chance to draw the map anyway. Is the difference? There's no flowers or anything. Sound doesn't appear to be it either. Our fence is foliage. Foliage sound. Is that I don't think that lines anything on purpose. So I'm hesitant to count that or anything. Hmm. Now I might as well try something. Uh um no, I haven't really figured out what the blocks are. The blockages for, for this section. Because it's not sound. No, wait. Thanks for the hint. Let's see here. Could I just not figure it out? I can't walk the path to get here that I drew. It's not an actual path.
straight. I believe up here. Let's see if my notes... Okay, no, I can't. Alright, let me... I think maybe here, here. Hopefully, with all my marks on that paper, I'll be able to recognize what path I took. Yep. Nice. <laughs> Thanks, dear. Yeah, I appreciate that that little hint because I was really stumped for a second. Because I figured that like I was beginning to notice that the that the uh, the hedges in this maze don't match up with the path that you can traverse there. It, like it wasn't like not all the paths were like. But whenever you said like try walking the path you drew, that's when it really hit me, like, oh, wait, yeah, no, that's it. That's a smoking gun. None of the paths you are, like, not all of them are valid. Oh, well. Path of the castle. I can actually earn the laser now? Interesting. Hello. I don't know why I'm doing the Kitsu voice, but... Sometimes you want to do Kitsu voice. Oh! Oh shit. What? Security guards with swords instead of guns. Yeah. What? <laughs> oh, wow. Let me whoop. go up here real quick. Any weird perspective thing? Might as well try. I'm always on the lookout for environmental puzzles now. But, um, yeah, to read from chat again, the back half of the castle has uh, one puzzle type you haven't found the tutorial to yet. These kill windows are too small to see the envir environmental puzzles through. And yeah, that tracks. I forgot what they're actually called, but kill windows is basically their exactly their function. How well? Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I don't remember all of these. Uh, all right, let me. All right, then again, I can look at through here. All right, so top left. Uh, 
Or I guess I can do it in the order that I went through all these from. Now would that work? Not sure. Uh, up. Right. Okay, I think I have... I have these two noted, I think. Think about this. Uh, all right. Uh. <laughs> oh boy. Um. Great. I'm. I'm now second guessing myself. But good thing I can see this from above. Uh, Let me... Mark this, um... this one. I think. Um, if, can I see how that one goes from here? Uh, <laughs> oh boy. Alright. I'm getting kind of impatient, but let's see. If I can do this, let's go. No, uh. oh, I was trying to just look, tilt the camera, but it was like, no. Vaguely remember something <laughs> like this. And true, I can rotate any of the maps I have drawn, but um, I should draw the. All right, yeah, I should draw the map that I'm looking at right now to make sure I'm getting it right. Um, Or can I see from here? Okay, yeah, I think I can see from here. Alright, yeah. I just need to... It's... Black. <laughs> Alright. Let me... Uh, 
Um, how many rows? Great. <laughs> now I want to go back down. Just so that I can more easily map this. Something that looks more appropriate to the... Do I have to... Well, I can make sure I get this right. Okay, yeah, I have this right, but might as well uh, copy it down more clearly, I think. Oh boy. Oh yeah, let me eat. <laughs> this I just now realized this may not be the most exciting stream, but like, but like, yeah. Sorry, it's just I'm focusing on puzzle. I'm my mind is very much in the puzzle zone. So I'm just making sure I have the puzzles filled out right. That should work. So I know that one is right. Um, let me go check the third. Oh, did I know anything about the fourth one compared to the other three? <gasps> um, no, not really. I think if you were to break up into grid, oh, the maze itself. Uh, no, not really. 
I mean... Actually, I've noticed that they're all, like, the Four Seasons. Like, uh, Spring... Or... No. Like, I think this is supposed to be, like... Uh, summer, or maybe that's summer. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not the best at determining uh, summer. Uh, Alright, let me think about this. The first one I can go into was this one. Which, might as well mark that one down as well. Just so that I have something I can look at. Autumn, then winter, spring, the summer. Yeah, I think that tracks autumn the winter the dying the spring the summer yeah uh well, okay actually the first one is like the easiest one but uh one, two, Let's put that there. The exit corridors can get you to the ending doors without having to go through the mazes, by the way. Oh, sure, but... Oh, no. <laughs> but now I... Um, oh, gosh, I feel like I should be... <laughs> this is a terrible video. <laughs> ah, oh, well. Alright, this is... You know what, Jazz? This is, this is watching me go through puzzle games of just... having to make sure I'm doing them right. Alright. <laughs> Thanks, dear. Alright, and then this is, uh, yeah. Number two. The only one I don't have any sort of map for yet. But I can remedy that one. I probably need a... Well... Whoop. Uh, Alright.
Uh, brain. Um, actually, right now I think I messed this up. Er, I think I can fix this. Alright, I think this is enough. And then... Wait, no, I need to... The shitness. <laughs> hey! Fun stuff, Avenue. Look, I don't... <laughs> I still feel weird calling you that, but at the same time... You have so many handles. <laughs> that I'm like, which, I think I forgot which one you were like, oh yeah, this is the one to call me. Like, I know you, you have Pokey on one thing. Oh. But yeah, we're playing The Witness, and I was in serious puzzle mode. Alright. Wait, oh. One. Then two. Um, I'm trying to remember how it was two. Oriented. Wait. Alright, so. Went around, did that one. Then, alright. Yeah. Three's oriented compared to all this. Actually, wait. No, I think I have it. I know. Uh. Can I... Now let, let me just make sure how that one's oriented. Alright. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Oh, nice amount. Er... Uh... Nice amount you got there. Oh. 
emoji. No, I... It, whatever. <laughs> Alright, so this... I should have went there back and checked on if I had three right, but uh this works. Let's go. I think I messed up somewhere on the third. <laughs> uh, I don't want to. Uh, let's let's go. No, I, I could try to guess it, but like, it would it would honestly just be easier if I go back and check the completed answer. Yeah. All right. Let's write this down somewhere. Uh, here, let's write this in a much better fashion. Uh, do you have any spare piece of paper? Alright, technically I do. Oh. Uh, no, I was gonna need more scrap paper for this anyway, so let me just get another one. Here, technically. Yeah, yeah, I can do on the back. But yeah, uh, how you been doing? Fun stuff. The stuff of fun. Uh. I hope you've been doing all right. Oh, yeah, I think that works. Maybe. Ah, uh, you know what? I guess I'm a bit tired because <laughs> my puzzle... <laughs> not my puzzle. I keep drawing weird maps. That I only realize that are a bit too big. A little bit too late, but... 
Let's go. Alright, this one's the easiest. No. Um, here we go. All right. Then it'd be like this. that corner where it begins. Alright. Oop. Alright. Here. According to my notes, unless I messed up somewhere. Actually, I might have messed up somewhere. Actually, that would make sense if I messed up somewhere. Was I looking at the wrong door? That might have... Might have made sense, actually. No, no. Looking at the right puzzle... Yeah, no, okay, I just made a weird mistake. Oh? No, good thing <laughs> I'm doing these as a... Oh! Activate the keep laser. Hell yeah. It's it's not lasering. Like look from above. Hey, nice. No, oh, yeah. Find out what's different about the fourth maze thing. Oh, yeah. But it's just, it was easier for me to do, you know, because if you try to back out from a puzzle to just look at, like, oh, hey, let me look at my clues again, it's, the game's like, no. You had to do everything from the beginning again. But yeah. yeah. Also, this looks like its own puzzle, which is gonna be fun. What's different about the fourth maze? I mean, I. To be honest, I don't know what's different about the fourth maze. I mean, other than the fact that its puzzle is different. I really don't know what what's so different about it. Oh! One of the hedges. What about one of the edges? 
No. This one's uh, circular. Now I get look at it from here. <laughs> A circular edge to line means that it's. Hmm. That means that it. Great. Let me go back to the top. Cause yeah, I can't really see it too well from here. I feel like I'm not at the right angle. Alright, so let me get down from here then. Also, let me adjust my posture a bit. Oh, you know what? Um, hmm. Actually, What if I get a... Do you want to know the right angle? Um, let me... Keep a lookout. Hello. Um... Okay, that's absolutely not the right angle for that. Now what, I guess my question would be, can I get to the right angle right now, or do I have to solve more puzzles to open up a path to look at it the correct way? Because I feel like I have to... Okay, I, I can do the right angle right now. Hmm. I guess my question... My part of me is hoping I can walk on this or something. Um. Hmm. Right now. No, I, yeah, I wouldn't mind some help of, like, is the tower part of it, I guess, or this tower that I'm looking at a part of it. That is some help I'd be willing to get. Alright, so it is at the top of the tower. It wasn't looking at it right. No, it, yeah. Cause it felt like this is like too narrow to get the view I need. Can I get higher? Uh, let me walk on this edge. Oh, wait, this bush. I thought you were talking about this one. Right here. Like, this one's also rounded.
Ah, okay. Now I know why it's around it. Rounded for the end of the line. No, that's absolutely fine, dear. I was just misguessing your hint. Or, yeah. Or not misguessing, like, you know what I mean. But yeah. Hey. Let's, um. Alright, so. These puzzles mean business. I boasted among men that I had known you. They see your pictures in all works of mine. They come and ask me, who is he? I know not how to answer them. I say, indeed, I cannot tell. They blame me and they go away in scorn. And you sit there smiling. I put my tales of you into lasting songs. The secret gushes out from my heart. They come and ask me, tell me all your meanings. I know not how to answer them. I say, ah, who knows what they mean? They smile and go gorn. And you, they're smiling. Rabindranath Tagore, 1910. Oh. Fascinating. Oh, I didn't see those pop up. All right. All right. Well, at least this is very me friendly. Uh, Because I can check my work. And then up. Oh boy, this is going to be a weird one. Uh, up twice, left once. Ugh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just like... Because um, I know there's that thing at the top that mirrored... Like... The one I... J the big puzzle I just did. So this one... Uh... Oof. <laughs> Alright. Uh, take one step at a time. Up twice, left once, up, right. Uh, Alright, yeah. Okay, if it, that has to be right, then snake up around. Alright, then down, left, down, alright. This one, 
be start here then. Not uh Uh, next steps would be down, down, left, down, left. And then I should be able to just circle around. Yeah. Down. Left. Down. Right. Down, left, left, all right. Do I remember how to do these? I think I remember how to do these. I just had to make sure that the to keep them separated, right? Yeah. Oh, the parts where this is broken, it's not otherwise interesting. It's not shown reflected up here. up then high. No, wait, that... Cause yeah, it's still separated. Alright, yeah, no, wait. Because, yeah, I would normally want to then move over here. Um, I don't know if doing this would be a legal move. Oh, my bitrate went down to something mighty low, or lower than the estimated, like, the normal of, uh, 5,000-ish, huh? Now let's check how I don't think this will be a legal move. But
Yeah. Thanks there. Because I'm... F All right. My hypothesis is if I were to go up, do something like... Th no, that wouldn't... Hmm. Does that work like normal? Oh. Oh. I wonder. Can I do some nonsense to isolate? I don't think it would be a valid line, but I feel like it's worth investigating. Actually, while I'm up here, and while this... Uh, that still works. Actually, let me see if that paint does anything weird. Okay, no, it does not. Alright, well... I was wondering if the paint would, like, screw with it or something. That looks like it's gonna be fun to explore. Actually. Okay, there's nothing that I notice as a environmental puzzle. Hmm. What does a black smear on the grid mean normally? A black smear? Um, no, it normally means you can't go through that area. If it's a smear, if it's a hexagon, that's a different story. Hexagon means you have to go through there. If a man, holding a belief which he was taught in childhood or persuaded of afterwards, keeps down and pushes away any doubts which arise about it in his mind, purposely avoids the reading of books and the company of men that call into question or discuss it, 
and regards as impious those questions which cannot easily be asked without disturbing it. The life of that man is one long sin against mankind. But, says one, I am a busy man. I have no time for the long course of study which would be necessary to make me in any degree a competent judge of certain questions, or even able to understand the nature of the arguments. Then he should have no time to believe. William K. Clifford, 1874. Oh shit, I can totally avoid those puzzles. Interesting. Ooh, I love this like lagoon, bayou, whatever area. Now if you look into the water right as you leave the back side of the keep, you'll see a friend. If you <clears throat> if you look into the water as you leave the back side of the keep, you'll see a friend. Um Um, there's another friend in the shadow of the water off the side of this rusted ship's bridge immediately when you leave the keep. Alright. Oh, that like a frog or something? That was octopus. That's cute. Octopus. <laughs> Shadow of the water off the side of the Rusted Bridge. Another friend in the shadow of the water off the side. Oh, I haven't found the bridge yet. Yeah, that tracks. Yeah, is that it? I have found it in Doritos. I haven't been keeping note of what these do yet, actually. Hmm. <laughs> Fascinating. I'm clipping that just so that I can remember it later. Um, da -da -da -da. It's kind of silly what your character will and won't 
walk onto at times. Alright, good now, but at the same time it's still nice to just appreciate the view. Cause this game really is gorgeous. Oh, those are sounds. Those Ooh, those are sounds. Sounds I don't like. Friend? A curvy green bit. Oh. I, that looks like something, but I can't really tell what. Think skeletal. Skeletal. I I don't know, like a skeleton or something. Hey, off or something. Oh, is this supposed to be the- oh, the Reaper? Oh, okay, that makes sense. Also, I think he's... spelt to do wrong, dear. Interesting, alright. A ship owner was about to send to sea an emigrant ship. He knew that she was old, and not well built at the first, that she had seen many seas and climes, and often had needed repairs. Doubts had been suggested to him that possibly she was not seaworthy. These doubts preyed upon his mind and made him unhappy. He thought that perhaps he ought to have her thoroughly overhauled and refitted, even though this should put him at great expense. Before the ship's sail collections, he said to himself that she had gone safely through so many voyages and weathered so many storms that it was idle to suppose she would not come safely home from this trip also. He would put his trust in Providence, which could hardly fail to protect all these unhappy families that were leaving their fatherland to seek for better times elsewhere. He would dismiss from his mind all ungenerous suspicions about the honesty of builders and contractors. In such ways, he acquired a sincere and comfortable conviction that his vessel was thoroughly safe and seaworthy. He watched her departure with a light heart and benevolent wishes for the success of the exiles in their strange new home that was to be. And he got his insurance money when she went down in mid-ocean and told no tales. 
what shall we say of him? Surely this, that he was verily guilty of the death of those families. It is admitted that he did sincerely believe in the soundness of his ship, but the sincerity of his conviction can in no wise help him, because he had no right to believe on such evidence as was before him. He had acquired his belief not by honestly earning it in patient investigation, but by stifling his doubts. And although in the end he may have felt so sure about it that he could not think otherwise, yet inasmuch as he had knowingly and willingly worked himself into that frame of mind, he must be held responsible for it. William K. Clifford, mm. 1874. Oh, so the, oh, oh dear, help, wait, um, how do I, oh dear. Afraid I needed to be like really high up or something. There are three lines in the ring here. Yep. will put you in place for the others. Oh. Nice. So now I know what you're talking about, Jazz, when you were mentioning- oh, another symbol. Lovely. Hmm. Oh yes, when you were mentioning, uh, the weird, like, quotes. Kinda thrown about. Oh. What? What? What does this mean? Oh no, I'd rather... No thank you. Hello. Oh. Mmm. How do I get out? I guess I just go through here. Oh yeah, this is... Yeah, I think... Yeah, I have no idea what that means. Uh Okay, I can leave through here as well. Gosh. <sighs> this one is completely <laughs> utterly wrong. That feels like a no-brainer. But, I am kinda confused on how to do the rest of this. Let's hmm. give a second. So should we count the paint as a hex? I mean... Maybe? I'm not sure. Also, wait, no. 
something about this feels wrong. Because if this can't be completed, like... Oh no, oh no, 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 wait. Because I'm trying to think of how do I complete the line to separate them. I, gosh, it's been, it's been a while since I've done one of the, uh, uh one of the, uh, puzzles with the black and white icons that you had to keep separate. So I feel like I kind of don't exactly remember how to do these. I know that... You need to keep, you need to have some sort of separation in the line between the, the, uh, the black squares and the white squares. So, like, something theoretically, like, going up here, going left, would, I think that would work by that thing, but hmm, not quite sure how to get everything else to cooperate. If I could go up, go here, but then, because if I have any line going through here, then I can't reach to, the, I can't reach the end. But, like, if I just go around here, then there's no separation. If I go down, I think that may not work. Because then I'm separating the black from the black. Which line? The one that just goes here, the uh, pitch. You can you can't separate black from black, dear. Oh, but uh, now I have another problem. I cannot reach that just because this is in the way. I wonder. Yeah. I think I accidentally stepped on something, yeah.
exhausting. Um, no, it's... Hmm. Let me check around here. Yeah, we can. Oh, okay, I can't really reach it. I think Dorito. Huh. Nice. And yeah, the quote from you, um, from you put on the main part I wanted uh, you to see was Octobuddy and Skelly Man. No, yeah, other fun, but yeah, this time, uh, yeah, this one I may come back to later if I can't figure out now. Because let me think about this. I feel like. Um, brain. What now? Okay, stop here and work from the end backwards now. Something tells me this may not work, but... Ah! Okay, wait. I think I have an idea why it won't work. Yeah. The black cubes would be here and here. And because of this, they'd still be connected to those here and here, which would be uh, white cubes. Alright, I think I'm getting close with this. So, let's keep going a little bit. You know, to keep them separated. Alright. I had a hit of that one, which would be right. I think, something like that. No, wait, if I... no. It's like here. I think. Cause yeah. Actually... Nuts. I forget that line. Ah, yeah, I still have. Thing or something. Uh. Hmm.
Hmm. No, I was going to try something silly, but... Actually, let me... No, this things is gonna be really goofy looking, but I I think it might work. Or not? I think it would tell me if it would work. Ah, yeah, no, that's my critical error. I forgot about here. <laughs> Darn. Um. Mm. Okay. That one's in this. But what do I do? Because that lets. This gives me an option to skip ahead a little bit, but I don't know if that, like, helps. This needs to be separated. mean cuz i need to go up now let me see how up or hmm actually actually All right, I think I'm... Uh, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I don't think this works. I mean, if I could head down You'll walk from the exit, as I said earlier. C can, can I? I mean, I... I, I need... Yeah, that you're like, oh, you can walk from the exit, but like, uh... Uh... Mm. I would then have to mark up all these other sections that I don't want. Like, this looks really doable, but I don't know how to counteract that. Because I can't skip this. I, I ain't got a jump button. Unfortunately, I can't walk or do anything fun. With this. If this looks, hmm, I think if this didn't have that thing in the way, this could be a solution, but, uh, with that thing, 
blocking the path, I don't think this works. No, it still wouldn't work, because, right, it would go down here, go here, I still have the white and the black. <sighs> Alright, now I think we'll save this. And, mm, I felt like I was getting close to this. I don't want to... Yeah, I, I feel like I'm close to, but let me... Hey, let me drink some more water. Alright, cool. Alright. Alright. <laughs> no, I... Oh, sorry, I'm just... Great, my brain... I'm starting to get distracted. Because I'm thinking of, like, you know, earlier, we just... <laughs> You know, Pokey just came in. It was like the shit miss, and then <laughs> that was the only comment. <laughs> just the shit miss, the the shit miss. Uh, and now my brain's kind of fried, but I this feels close, and I want to do it. But I like. This feels either like it's a red herring or it's supposed to be a hit of some sort. I'm not sure. Because I feel like this has to be, like, that previous one had to be a completely valid line to work. It feels like that has to be the case for this as well. Right, let me just look at that again. Yeah. To get that one connects it to the top. So if I were to do something silly, like go up here, go up here again, then I can't really disconnect that. No, that wouldn't work. Hmm. I feel like I'm so close. Like, uh, I think my brain getting fried there. Of, there, um, why is it silly? No, no, it, um, I was thinking if I were to, like, I feel like I'm going at it the wrong way because. Uh, I guess, wanted to get, like, if I want to get that one that we're treating as a hex, because he told me to treat it like a hex, you said that it seems like a hex, I was like, okay, and it's, like, along this path that I have to be really careful with what I do because, like, I can't really, you know, with how I get there. Because if I just go up from here, then right, that cuts off this white from this black. Which is good and ideal, but then... So a vertical line down the middle might be involved. I... No? No, I, I was just getting there just so that I can show that the thing that you told me to treat as a hex, from your suggestion that we should treat it like a black hex, that means I have to pass through it, is over here. So, like, whatever, like, I'm just trying to think, like, going up here, or... Er, Starting here, going left, going up, going right, that separates this group of white. 
but then it leaves this. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it, I don't need to make it treat it like a hex? Oh. Okay. Okay. Alright. I'm still... I still wish I can go up here. That would just make everything much easier, but... Okay, do not dwell on that. Because I feel like... The, that's an unsolution. And now it's fine, but then don't worry about it. Because that, because honestly, like, again, let me just mark that. Honestly, I thought that either was a hex or like, oh, a part that I'm not supposed to go through. Because, you know, some, uh, some lines in normal puzzles, uh, let me show what Earth I'm talking about. Right, have the little dashes in them. I thought the black uh, pitch on there was something like that. Original, either that or a hex. Like a hexagon that I have to go through. But. Hmm. That's it. I feel like this area right here needs a line. I cannot get around that. Because I need some way to separate these two. And it feels like it has to do that. But, then my problem becomes, how do I separate it? It may be silly. Alright, and then to be a valid line. Um, okay, I had an idea. Thinking, go down. I know I can't go up here, but they can go. Go left. Go left. Go here. No, that wouldn't work. I still need a line here. Because I was thinking something silly of, like, going down here, making the light go there, and then this black would be separated from this white, but then this white would be separated from this grouping of black. <sighs> hmm. Now, I've spent quite a bit of time on this one, but I, I, I was feeling so close. I guess the thing that hurts that I like, ah, I was, I thought, I guess I don't, maybe I wasn't as close as I thought because, or then again, it is, I am kind of tired. <laughs> Today's been kind of weird, but like, with uh, headaches and whatnot. But I was like, no, I could puzzle. And for the most part, I did do quite a few puzzles, so like, that works. But yeah, this is just the weird part. What connection needs to be made from the ending line? Uh, no, to read from, uh, that was from but one. But, um, I feel like this needs to be made. There's no ands, if, or buts about it. And I would draw that line, but I can't. Does it go up, down, up, down, or to the middle of the grid? It goes to the middle of the grid. Because I can't imagine something going around here, going like that, and then leaving this bare. 
I cannot get close to this, or if I go through here at all, which I need to to be able to separate these groups, then it has to go through the middle. There's no way it cannot go through the middle. Actually, wait, no. Um, no, let me do a bit more of my silly idea now that I think about it. Got it. Alright, so I was close. I was doubting myself a lot from being a bit tired, but yeah. Just parkour across. Hey! What's up? Yeah, earlier I just saw your message of the shitness and then nothing. I was just wondering, did he just come to the stream to say the shitness and then like bounce out? I don't know. Like, I know, like sometimes, like, you just join a stream and you just kind of chill. And I'm like, like, I. Are they still here? <laughs> they just got to save the shit. <laughs> but yeah. I mean, that's fair. Uh, let's see, I'm trying to remember. Oh yeah, a while back I shared the video of Jonathan Blow. Ah, okay. That's cool. That's fine. I I definitely know that feeling of, like, being called to help out with something or whatever, so yeah. That's fair. Oh yeah, what now? The worst part about these ones is that they're now filled lines. Yeah, that is the worst part about these. Because Jonathan Blow and- oh yes, um, the video I, I shared of- from the clip from the indie game, like, Indie games, the movie, or whatever video games, the movie, whatever it's called. Of just Jonathan Blow <clears throat> crying. I don't think I've ever done these puzzles yet, which is terrifying. Uh, yeah, where he gets, it's like Jonathan Blow crying in the dark <laughs> because Soldier Boy misunderstood his game. Yeah, I love the editing for that movie. And also, I love the fact that out of every, out of, like, yeah, like, the thing, right, do you know that Jonathan Blow, like, one of his parents is, like, uh, some major, like, if, I think his father had, like, some major contract with, the, like, Raytheon or some other, like, military contractor or something like that. And, I mean, like, after I learned that, like, a lot of his other stuff became... Like, it made a bit more sense of, like, that, you know, he feels, like, kind of very self-important, takes himself too seriously. Because, like, in that cause documentary, he's like, oh, the thing that hurts me the most is when people who really enjoy the, my game and give it, like, you know, 10 out of 10 or whatever, but they don't comment on the specific things that I think are the most important about the game, and it's like, are you seriously upset at people who really enjoy your game for not, like, you know, it's like, they haven't been in your head for the amount of time it takes to make, you know, the, your game, like, you know, it's like they can't pick up on everything that you, that you know is the most important part of it, and it's like, and then, uh, of course, getting upset at Soldier Boy, where it's like, man, like, just have fun, because he sees a little dude, a little video gamesman, and he just kind of goes, whoop, oh, oh no. Also, I think this, um, and it's just, the, the editing in that clip is just so good, of just Jonathan Blow, just so distraught. Also, I think I'm doing this right, of... Hmm. Ah. That does that part, so I can walk over. Cool. 
Uh, I, I think this is the part on just going off raw intuition here. I forgot how many squares that other one is. Uh, one, two, three, four. All right. All right. Yeah, my intuition was correct, and now I'm deathly afraid to walk on these because Jonathan Blow and his dastardly puzzles. <laughs> Thanks, dear. But yeah, I'm I'm happy I was able to puzzle that out because I didn't get the tutorial for it yet. But after looking at it and seeing, you know, like what is in here and what's not in here, like I was like, okay, there's not much to work on. <laughs> Johnny's trick. I know. <laughs> Johnny's trick. I, I don't even know what the, the reference to, but I just love it. I just love it. It's really good. Oh no. Oh yeah, this is the one that had the Dorito. Joker's trick Twitter. Intuited aligned aligned Trichinos. Can can you intuit spun Tetris? Uh I have an idea. It may be a terrible idea. Uh, oh boy. Um maybe symmetry. Symmetry? Oh yeah, these are symmetrical. Um not let's see how oh god no. Oh no. Oh no, alright. Let me think. If right, I guess I can show it here, right? Using my handy cursor. Right, normally I would assume that this means it has to be like this kind of deal, but because it's rotated, I think it means it has to do some weird like this kind of deal where it makes a diagon no, that, I don't know if that makes any sense spun to <laughs> spun titronominos and symmetry Titronimos. That's how you, that's how you pronounce it. Then it's oh, then again, it's a made up word, so I don't feel I shouldn't feel so bad for like getting the pronunciation a bit wrong for a weird word. Um, in the video game, I I don't get the spun. I think having not seen the tutorial for the, the toot romper minions, <laughs> Titronim. <laughs> Gosh, um... Oh boy, I, like, mm. Would that even work for it to be... One, two, three... Maybe? I don't know. Because, <laughs> then again, I feel like if it was supposed to be at a 45, a weird 45 degree angle, Tetronimo's, then it would be white. No, I don't. Th wait. That may work. I think. Maybe. All right. Let me. Let me try. Let me attempt. Johnny's trick. I think. Uh. No, I don't think... Okay, I did this the wrong way. Because if it's tilted... That could... Mm, I don't know. Uh, part of me wonders if it's 
like if it's supposed to be like tilted more like at a 45 degree angle try to translate that um great i was working on something yes i was something silly No, that can't work. No, that's fair. Um, it's a cool puzzle game. How could you draw opposing 4 to 5 degree angles in the symmetrical grid? That's what I'm trying to... F um... Because now I can't draw up here. Because because of this little bit, I want to draw up here, but I'm not sure that could work. Da, 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 da. Forty-five degree angle. Uh, all right. I feel like it'd be something like that, but forty-five degree angle. Alright, I think I have an idea. Try it. We... We... Whatever. <laughs> um... Oh, okay. I appreciate your typos here. Um, no, uh, am I, is it that 45 degree angles, or did I just rotate it 90 degrees? Uh, I don't know. All right, or er, if I f also flip, no, if it's even f 45 degrees, how can a 90 degree grid have 45 degree angle? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> I'm like, I can't really do that, so I don't really know what spun means. Johnny's trick. No, I, um, I have to ask, what does the, uh, you know, the insert Blake trick come, where did that come from? Because it cracks me up every time I see it, but I have no idea where it's from, but it's just Johnny's trick. Like, <laughs> that's just embedded into my, into my memory now. Oh, Joker's trick. Oh, I can... Spun. What does spun mean? Does it just mean like Tetris spun? Or is it like something else? Johnny, where's the tutorial for this? Um. Er, no, I have an idea. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. No, going down would be bad. You could tell me the Tetris zone. No, it. That may be. Jonathan, <laughs> there is the tutorial. Die. Blow. <laughs> no, it. Um. Sure, where is the Tetris zone? I'm guessing I just somehow passed it because. Actually. I'm going to say, I'm going to give credit to the swamp. Interesting. Because um, there are tutorials, but they're very, like, they're puzzle tutorials. Right? Like, outside of the swamp. No, I, we're gonna... Oh god, no, I don't want to, I don't want to go through here. <laughs> I don't want to fuck up. Uh... <laughs> Oh. 
oblivious puzzle, obvious puzzles. But yeah, it's where it's like, it, well, it's not too obvious, but it's kind of like the most basic understanding of how to do the puzzles. Kind of, and they get a bit harder. And then, like, you just kind of do them, and then it's like, once a line is drawn, it's solid. What? Ultra Kill is a secret level base on this game? Named The Witless. <laughs> okay, that's fun. That's very fun. Um, okay, so I don't have to... Oh, thank God. How do I get back to... Yep. No enemies, just some simple witness puzzles. Oh, nice. That's cute. Um, wait, how do I get down there? Can I get to the swamp? Like, I'm. No. Yeah. Did you see? Oh, yeah. Octo Buddy. Out the front of the hedge mage size. What? Out the front of the. I. I. Yeah, I'm kind of turned around. <laughs> and since we're going a bit longer than normal, want to head up the. So I can't get to the swamp from here. Wait, there's bees in Fallout 76. You shoot them with your lair. <laughs> Just fucking fight a bee. But just normally, that's so weird, because like Fallout's all about weird giant enemies or whatever. This is Jonathan Blow's trick. So, that's so weird. Why just fight normal bees? That's I literally hate that in games where it's like, ah, you have to fight a normal ass insect. And it's like, or I say games, I've only really done that in uh, D and D. It just it always feels like a weirdest thing. It's like, ah, you gotta fight normal bugs to the death, and it's like, it's a bug. Also, huh? Oh, weird. Also, just normal bees that want to kill you. That's so weird. But, um, to read Pivon, uh, this is the forest, the opposite side of the keep to the swamp. Uh, womp. That's so weird, because, like, fall, it's all about the old sci fi tropes of giant insects. Ooh. So, like, why fight normal bees? Also, I... Would... Would... Okay. Would a laser gun be good against a swarm of bees? Because it's a swarm of bees. Right, and it's like, you take out, like, a dozen bees in, like, a whole swarm, but, like, oh, this is gorgeous. Shout out to the, like, this, like, the art design. This is fucking gorgeous. I love this. Also, I feel like I should be <laughs> stopping soon, but I want to hit the puzzles. What? Ah, I think I found it. The tr tetron, tr 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 yeah, Tetris. Also, 
Aren't I supposed to be able to swap? I feel like there's a functionality that I'm not able to do anymore. Like, I'm supposed to be able to... quick swap between related puzzles like this, using a, a stick. Alright. Yeah, movement left plus right definitely should work, but like... Yeah. Yeah, maybe I was a bit too far away. Alright, so that still counts. Ah, yeah, I was too far away. Okay. Oh, this is... Oh, that's so good. Oh, this contrast. Ooh. Ooh, I love this. That's, that's some good art. Yep, I know, the other side. I was just appreciating that good, good art. Now let me... Eat. Yep, no, that one has to be... Either two, but because of the break, ah, uh, the break in between counts for both of them. All right. Oh. I can't... can't do that. Yeah, now, this orientation of this matters. Uh... Now, I, I did that exact move several times now. What did you do on the previous puzzle? The block in between counted for both of them. What shape was made? Oh! Oh, the shapes combine. It yeah, the shapes combine. No, 
uh, hmm. Alright, I'm... Because my instincts... Alright. Like, yay. Stack... Oh, stack them? Oh, I mean, okay, let me... Alright, if I stack them in my mind, or... Let me... Right, I... Like, I want to do something like this, then. But... Or do they? Do they get to do something like this? Oh, it still work like this. Ah, is it because this is also a two by two shape, so it gets to stack? All right. All right. So that does get to stack. Because it's also two by two. They're not also two by two, but yeah, they they would fall in like this. Oh, wait. Wait. Mm. Mm. Okay, let me go back to this one. Right. I'm guessing because this, or that, because this would be two by two, and this is on the side of it. This left square would go to the left here. That's what it's implying. <laughs> it's more water, real quick. All right, so what rules do I think there are so far? Let's go. Here, you must separate it out, the shape out. One, complete the puzzle. That shows, yeah, different shapes. This one's a cube, so it has to be a cube shaped. This one, you have to make out or separate from the rest of yeah, the puzzle that L shape. Here, it shows that separated lines like this, they can be done separately. But here, because of the, the, the line here, the broken line here, right, or not the broken line, like, but they can also be combined. So two at the top get to make, or two on top of each other, or two single ones on top of each other make a double line, or a double square. Uh, one, the shapes, you know, they combine even without a broken line in between. Here they stack, here they stack as well, like they're implied to stack as if it was this way, basically. Cause like, yeah, nothing else I did really worked for that one. Cause I thought it would be like a four cubes here, with this one having to be in there, and then this connecting to that, but that didn't really work out, no matter how I, I tried to cut it. So the two dot isn't in the left hand, isn't in the end block of its shape. Yeah, okay. Okay, even is in the left hand block of its shape, so the same thing here, they combine together in total. Oh boy, this is. this is rude. Wait. Yeah, because this is the cube in three, and instead of stacking on top or being at the bottom, it's yeah, the face goes there, goes over there. This 
but mm. Okay, and it can still do something weird like that. Alright. Oh, this blue is so good. I love the color and contrast in this place. Alright. Okay. It's almost 11 o'clock. I, I feel like stopping... Ah, I almost feel like stopping, but... No, yeah, I should probably stop. For now. Or for tonight, at least. But... We've made some progress, and we've we've gained knowledge of. No, right, let me just do this one real quick. Of the Tetronomos. Uh... What? What did I turn on? Oh. What shape do the platforms currently have? They have the L shape. Or not the L, but the... Yeah, the long Tetron... Tetron move. There's two wires coming from the puzzle. I wonder... How did I do this before? I'm <laughs> Alright. Alright. What? I'm trying to do thing the speedy option, but betraying me. I didn't like this. But Now that didn't work. That explicitly did not work. Alright. So I did these puzzles. This went up. Can you get over there? No, it. I think. Okay, let me look at this again. Okay, yeah, I did something like this, and then... That solved that. Ah. What? Yep. Huh. That's funny. That's funny, actually. 
I'm moving between red and blue. Oh. Nice. But now I think with that, though, <laughs> I'm getting tired. I should probably <laughs> stop streaming for now, but... Ah, this was a blast, though. So thanks for coming to... Uh, let's see here. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Hmm. Not yet. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm just kind of tired. But yeah, thanks for watching, y'all. I hope y'all have a good time. No, thanks for watching. Uh, this is fun getting going back into streaming. I'm kind of surprised I took an extra hour than I normally do, but... Look, puzzle games are hard, and sometimes you're like, hey, I want to make the extra progress. But yeah, thanks for watching. I'll catch y'all next time. I'll probably try to do a bonus extra stream of, again, of something. I don't know. I'm trying to look at a channel to the host. Or, not host. Not host. What's that ah, raid? Ah ha ha. Uh, now I, uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't think of anyone to raid, really, other than, like, someone I followed a while back, but then I haven't really had the chance to watch any of their streams, which would feel kind of weird to just raid some random person that looks up, but... Now I... When, when do I get the... Um, okay, so to get the super, the super shotgun... You had to go back to the desert. Uh, there's a hidden code you had to do. It's like the Trichonominos, except it's like arrows. You had to do the Konami code of all things. Go to the start of the game. Press, uh, hold down the left, left on the analog stick, and the right, the left and, you know, the left on one analog stick, the right on the other, and spin around for like five minutes straight, and then you get the super shotgun, and it allows you to blow apart, uh, puzzles. <laughs> That's how that works, right? Anyway... No, I, I... I like... Now oh, that, that's more than fair. That... Yeah... I... Think... We're gonna... No, I... I you know, I, I'll... We don't gotta raid. I want a Ganter raid, because that's fun, you know, and, like, when it happens to you and you're streaming, you're like, oh, hey, that's cool, but, no, yeah, I'm kind of tired, I don't really know. <laughs> no one that I'm too familiar with is streaming right now, so, I'm like, yeah, whatever. I can say that for another day, but, yeah. Good night, y'all. Thanks for, thanks for being here while I bonk my head against puzzles. I mean, okay. There's some points where I was more... You know, I've been actively solving a lot of these puzzles, but some of them were just kind of like... A, a weird combination of me being tired. Um, yeah. B-drops. Actually... Yeah, ah, uh, thanks. Thanks for stuff. It's oh, it's nice to... Have peeps and friends enjoying the streams as well. But, yeah, I was thinking either B-drops or... Action Shakespeare... Anyway, ah, uh, we don't, don't, don't need to raid right now. That could be another thing, but yeah. <sighs> Good night, y'all. Peace.